Look, 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 Hey, no. Y'all, I think, man, I be having to give y'all, like, a school lesson every time I make videos. Because a lot of y'all niggas just real life airheads. We just gonna be honest. A lot of y'all airheads on bro. Straight. Just a, a big head full of uh. And niggas whole mindset is literally whatever y'all see the, the majority say, y'all say. But look, folks, let me just tell y'all this, folks. You remember how you was in school, right? And when you was writing a the paper, they told you that your title's supposed to be attention grab and it's supposed to be eye catching. Something that's going to make the people think like, oh, man, I got to see what's next. That's what YouTube is, stupid man. That's what YouTube is, bro. And yeah, bro, basically that ain't even much I need to but say. I just felt like y'all needed to hear that, man. Maybe y'all would, you know, stop crying. Not only stop crying, but listen beyond just looking at the title. You feel me? But anyway, let me get into the story, man. Some of y'all might have heard me. Speak on it. Some of y'all might have not, but um, it was the time that you know uh, we was looking for butter, man. We was looking for butter. Did not go well. It did not end well for us during the uh, like during the search, man. We we had a lot of fun. I say back then, y'all know me, man. Ain't none of this uh, that lifestyle and what we was doing. The story, you know, none of this to be glorified, but it was what it was, man. We our fun again came. And the likes of, man, hurting other people, folks. That's, ain't it crazy that's how it is in the hood, folk, that our fun, most of it comes from harming other folks. But, man, that's the way of the world. That's the way of the world. But anyway, man, directly into the story. Man, we was looking for butter. Why was we looking for butter specifically? I cannot. I really don't remember what it was, why we was looking for him specifically, man. But me... Just the names that y'all will remember, man. T Roy, y'all don't know Stone Tom. But um, yeah, you know, just but I don't think Sean was with us. It was uh it was just like really just the older slash like niggas that was in my age was uh really that y'all would know is uh, T Roy for T Roy. Um yeah, just T Roy. Anyway, man, so we was going around, we looking for uh for butter, man. It's probably like 12, 13, 14 of us. And around this time, you could obviously we walking around. We didn't have no pose, no none of that. This was a different timing. And Butter had connections to O Block because his cousin, Keyshana, was like, you know, one of the girls. She lived on the block. Everybody loved Keyshana. They still love Keyshana to this day. And this Butter, Butter cousin. also used to always be around us, man. There was another story that I'm probably going to tell, man, later on this week about us fighting 600. And, you know, Butter was done. You know, just some of the memories that I had with Butter. But, um. Yeah, man, so we walking around, we looking for him. Before we get to him, man, it was just a, a, a few groups of different people, man. It was just one dude, man, God forgive us, man, God forgive me. Um, you know, I don't really even like to talk talk about the story so much, but he had a cast on, he had crutches. His homie didn't have no cast on. It was two of them, but we just walking around looking for butter so bad. Basically, anybody who... Was around that area, bro. We was whooping up, but we saw them in. For again, man, that that the spirit that was just going through us, but well, we was whooping everybody. We didn't even care that folks was um disabled. Man, I be thinking like that. I wonder if folks was in a wheelchair. Well, we had gave them a pass, like <laughs> just how we was back then. From hardly gave passes, hardly, hardly, hardly gave passes. Like it was just rare that we get passes. So we, you know, we just beat up a few folks on the way to him, man. And, um, to, to cut it short, to get it to right to where the port was, where we kind of ran. Well, not kind of ran, nigga, we ran. But, man, we standing in the middle of the street, literally on, what, 62nd? Y'all, man, I don't know. Man, y'all don't, a lot of y'all ain't even never been to Chicago. Y'all don't know about the uh, whereabouts that I'm talking about anyway. So we basically on 62nd, where the building used to be at. But um, we in the streets, so like, like a little bit outside of from the grass part. Man, anyway, one dude come out. He short. He swole. I'm thinking, man, we. I'm in my head like, oh, yeah. It's time because it's like this whole time we looking for butter. We done, man, like we let niggas know like we looking for butter. Like y'all see butter, let him know we looking for him. And it's a different type of time. 
And uh, like, so obviously if we was doing this, we could do, we could do so it wasn't that, it wasn't like, and it wasn't that bad, that bad, like how it is, how it is. Now never, you could never walk around doing this. But so anyway, the drift though, uh, we must have got back to butter, man. And next thing you know, we just right there and they pop out. Like we basically was walking back to the block, which was the crazy thing. Like from coming from along our journey, they find us. Basically walking back to the block. And at first, it only seemed like it was like three, four of them. But man, before he come out, he cracking his knuckles. He, yeah, we heard y'all was looking for butter. We we was. Me, T. Roy, and told. I remember it like it was yesterday. Like, we stood out. Yeah, I'm taking my jacket off. I'm putting my jacket on the floor. But as I'm putting my jacket on the floor... I see, like, we start seeing, y'all remember how the Warriors was, for, I, if you heard me study the story before. Oh, yeah, he definitely said that last time. Yes, because that's how it was, folks. It's like he said, the Warriors come out and play. Niggas start coming out the trees. They start jumping off top the roofs. That's how it felt. I'm talking about, niggas, I swear we thought niggas was coming out the cracks of the buildings that we didn't even, bro, I'm talking about, it was so many of them boys. So many of them that. Me, Tony, Troy, like, we had not ran first. I could just remember looking towards J9 them, looking towards Marcus them, and they peeling out. I'm talking about they on their way back to the block, they peeling out. Me, T-Roy, and Tone, we was like, Tone was one of T-Roy um, cl close friends, you know, um, when he met him at uh, Dulles. I think they probably met, like, T-Roy in the eighth grade being at Dulles. And it was just us three right there. We ready to rock. I mean, like, it was a lot of them, but, like, bro, I don't know. Niggas just got certain thrills inside of fights, but, bro, I guess they ain't seen all them running like that, folks. Everybody start belling out. Everybody pilling. Everybody dipping. But um, I can remember, like, and TP was right. Folks is right next to me. I'm fast in my head. I know I get caught. But I, because I ran so late that I remember running past TP, like, and he being on, like, my left side, I'm Damn, and I'm on my head like they probably finna catch folks. Cause they done know was on my app because I ran so late. Me and Tony and T Roy and I'm like, we ran so late. They ended up catching folks. And so we basically standing right by Dulles, bro, and we watching them whoop folks. I'm talking about, man, it's about it's about 50, bro. Dead serious. It it had to be none less. Ask butter than man. I know he know. It had to be none less than about 40, 50 of them boy. I'm talking about we watching them stump folks. I mean, literally, some dude did like a combination. He jump up, kick folks, then he hit him on top of his head with a bottle. Bang! The bottle then in. Break that bit. No! I'm not T Roy, folks. Like, I was angry and I'm like, bro, come on, we need to go back, y'all lame. Like T Roy, he crying, he punching the guy. <laughs> Niggas punching the garbage can. Boom, 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 boom. I'm like, man, forget punching the garbage can. We need to go back. I was ready to go back, but I wasn't finna go back by myself. No matter how good you fight, you're not gonna, that's not going to be a fight that you can win, folks. They made my boy, they made my boy, oh, uh, man, he shit on himself. He shit on himself, peed on his, they, they got down on us. It was look for, man, long story what you can gain out of that. It's, folks, the whole day, we was looking for trouble. And, nigga, when the trouble came to us, we was not ready to, folks, man, you could literally learn out of every little situation in life, nigga. You out there calling saying you want this, you want that. But, nigga, when it comes to you, you're going to be prepared for it. You're going to be ready for it. And more serious things that you can literally translate that over to, folks. Funny story, yeah. But, man, you can See, learn man, from it. Y'all definitely hit that like button for the boy, man. We're going to have, it's going to be more stories this week. I'm going to have more, um, you know, the, the funny stories is cool. But I'm going to have some emotional stories. What it was like for me. You know, seeing some of the guys stressed out or, you know, coming back from certain practices and, you know, hearing about it. But it's all to change our mindset. Value your life over image, man. V. Lloyd. Rest in peace. V. Roy and T. Roy. That's how we going to do that, man. We going to.